Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, Internet, who is uh, watching us in the Internet. Uh, yes, my name is Riyadh. I'm from Palestine, from uh, West Bank, Ramallah. And uh, here's a lot of my friends, uh, also from uh, Palestine. Hi, guys. So, uh, promoting LARP in uh, new places. And uh, really, I want to start my presentation with uh, this uh, game. With this game, uh, it was designed three weeks ago by uh, Syrian in uh, Gazi Antap in the south of Turkey. A game about two villages. One uh, of them uh, is um, with the regime and the other one against the regime. The game about peace building and how can LARP play and help in understanding the other side. So this is one of the pictures. The game uh, was one of four games uh, that was designed by the participants. The participants went through six days of training and designing LARP in, in Arabic. So you can see some of the pictures, how they play the games that they designed. The training used the LARP write, uh, writing summer school methodology developed in Arabic. We uh, have full uh, training package. Uh, definitions and uh, terminology all in Arabic we designed it uh, this year so you can see uh, how they uh, do the relationships between uh, the characters you can see how they start talk about the characters also some characters and how they can know about themselves and uh, here I want to tell you a funny story about September a demonstration, a LARP demonstration uh, near Beit uh, Beit uh, Syria in, in the street. Uh, some Syrian was shouting against the, the regime. Then some Turks living uh, around uh, the place start calling police. Listen, guys, there are some Syrian are uh, taking some uh, papers and shouting. So come, please, and help us what they are doing there. So you really, as you can see that uh, it's not easy to, uh, to bring Syrian to Turkey and to, uh, to do LARPs, especially if we are doing the LARP uh, outside, uh, outside the, uh, the building. So this is our experience in September uh, last year. Also, uh, we uh, give uh, some uh, games there, introducing games, because uh, all these uh, Syrians are new to LARP, new to the concept of LARP. So we do some games, and one of the games was a Palestinian game. Called, uh, we call it uh, Honor Killing, and uh, other games that also was produced on uh, that workshop in September 2014. Uh, to tell you more, uh, we also uh, promote LARP in different uh, platforms, uh, Salto, Euromed, and uh, Rasmus Plus in uh, Europe. And this is uh, Tool Fair Romania in uh, Cluj in uh, November 2014, and uh, we produced the Superheroes game. Some participants, uh, 15 participants, participate in uh, that game, and we introduced LARP uh, there in, in Romania. Then, uh, in Venezia and uh, Malta, workshop about what is LARP at, at the trainer, Trainers Forum, and uh, Mohammed was uh, presenting the LARP, and how can we use LARP in, in our life. So this is Malta and Venezia. Then the most important uh, LARP uh, experience, first training in LARP designed in Arabic for 27 Palestinians all over the West Bank. And uh, here the starting of the workshop, then uh, jam session to do the jam session for the LARP, then uh, pitching the games, the ideas about what they want to, uh, to play. What next? What next? We uh, already have partners and uh, we are thinking this year to go to Jordan to promote LARP in Jordan. Egypt, we are also thinking to go to Tunisia and definitely we are going to Morocco to produce the LARP there with our uh, partners. And definitely, we need your support because you are uh, very famous in LARP and you are playing LARP uh, so uh, long years, so it really would be nice to, if you can uh, support us. And uh, to end my presentation, definitely I want to go back to 2011. 
at uh, this uh, start, the 2011, when uh, Fantasy for Bonding uh, came to Palestine and introduced uh, the LARP for the Palestinians. And uh, yesterday in, uh, in Oslo uh, was the uh, book release of uh, Birth of uh, LARP in the Arab World. Soon you will see it, you can find it uh, in, the, in the internet. So these are our uh, projects in the uh, coming future. Thank you very much.